Thanks for tuning into our channel. I'm Tish. And I'm Trey. And you're watching Tish, Tish and Trey. Trey. So today the question came via text message from my good sis. And she asked, how do you know if that person is the one? Do you understand? You go ahead. Okay, so basically, um, it's just how is this person treating you? Um, does he support your vision? Since he came from... A female does he support your vision or if a guy has this question does she support your vision do y'all share shared visions um, do y'all support each other there for each other no matter what the biggest thing for me um, when I was you know with Trey and how I knew that he was the one um, I had this peace like God gave me this peace and I didn't feel anything you know how people Sometimes they question people and they feel like, uh, I don't know if he cheating, I don't know what he doing, I don't know if this is the right person for me. I never had any doubts and yeah, the peace was the biggest thing for me. Also, um, you're, if y'all are transparent, do y'all share everything with each other? Do you feel like he's he wants to build with you? You know, not he's not always just concerned about building for himself but building for y'all does he speak about a future for y'all you know with the future family and those type of things um you know shared goals does he push you does he motivate you i'm i'm i can keep going on and on but um, yeah my my opinion to this question is uh basically really falls back to sacrifice like mm -hmm. how much how much is this person willing to sacrifice for you mm -hmm. because you know, we live in such a selfish world, so everybody just trying to get out. Like, me, 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 me. Like, and when you know you found the one, the person is just really and truly ready to just give their all to you and just sacrifice everything on the line. Like, especially for, for a woman looking for a guy. Like, if he's there just sacrificing for you and just, you know, you want some of his food, you taking off his plate, he just Always. willing to, to give it. And he's, uh, and also just... Finding that, that godly person, really, that's on the same path that's pursuing God, mm -hmm. that's that's definitely the person that you're looking for. Someone that's pursuing God, has self-control, mm -hmm. and self-discipline, and that's, that's ready just to settle down, and they know, they have their mind made up, they have a vision, they have somewhere where they're going. That's how you know when they're the right one for you. Also, just like, how, how does he treat you? Does he respect you? Does he talk to you crazy? Does he call you... You know all the different types of names just how does he refer to you um is a good question also um do you trust this person do you know that if he's around a bunch of females or if she's around a bunch of guys do you know that they're truly not gonna you know cheat or do wrong um or another thing uh also is this person real and transparent because yeah. you got to be willing to just tell everything to your partner everything that you've been through like you got to be willing to because if uh if they don't accept you like they got to be willing to accept who you, you were in the past mm -hmm. and who you are now like they got to be willing to accept all of that so if they're willing to accept all the dirty that you've been done mm -hmm. that's how you know they're the one also um how do your friends and family like him like or her like him or her um, because it's it's really hard, you know, having somebody that your family doesn't like or your friends doesn't like. I mean, it's not about them, but if your family and friends don't like this person, it's probably for a reason. They're probably, you know, it's probably a sign that this person is probably not for you. Um, I mean, some, some circumstances are different, but a lot of the times people are looking out for you, yeah. not hating on you. They're, they're just telling you the truth, you know. Right. Um, but yeah, like... Also, the biggest thing to me, I would say, is the peace. The peace that you have, mm -hmm. that you should have um, with this person. You know, you should know that this person got your back, gonna have your back, you know, always, gonna always be honest with you, always transparent, like he was saying. And it's this person just willing to, you know, be there through thick and thin for real. Like, have you seen that from this person? Like, they're willing to do whatever it takes, you know? Be there in the rough times or the good times. And sacrifice. Like you said, that was a good one. Sacrifice. Like, Amen. I feel like a relationship, I feel like love is sacrifice. I don't feel like you really love a person if you're not willing to sacrifice for them. That could be money-wise. Like, you don't got it. This your last, but they need it. Like, it shows, you know, a lot of things will show this yeah. person. 
It's definitely, it's definitely a different feeling, like, because if you're not willing to sacrifice that person, I mean, like, if that person's not willing to sacrifice for you, <laughs> they're not the one for you, definitely. Yeah. And also, is this person your best friend? Like, I feel like this is this is my best friend. Like, I feel like if I didn't have any other friend ever again in my life, I'd be fine with just him. Vice, vice versa. Like, vice versa. Um, does your partner feel make you feel safe? They make you feel confident in yourself? Are they building you up? Not trying to tear you down? Mm -hmm. And you know, just also transparency again. Like, sometimes you don't look good in that outfit. So you need you need somebody to tell you, you the truth. Like and you have to be willing to accept and take the truth. Like everybody wants somebody to be truthful right. with them, but when they when somebody is truthful with them, they don't know how to take it. Yeah. So the truth hurts. Yeah, That's what I've been does. learning, man. The truth hurts. Yeah. But yeah, but we we've just been it's been a lot going on. We've been um, on a fast from social media for two mm -hmm. weeks now, and tomorrow we actually get. Re rededicating our life to Christ and getting baptized tomorrow, so tomorrow will be an amazing day, and we we uh, come this is, off this our is fast. How, you know, this is the one for me. You know, Amen. we're building together, building um, in Christ, growing a stronger relationship with Him together and yes. individually. Yes. Um, working on our finances. Yes. Everything. It's and just the good. blessings just fall into place. We just. Mm -hmm. We just seeing it just fall from our eyes. Our praying eyes. together. It's, it's amazing. Praying together and reading the Bible together every yes. single day. Yes. Every single day. Um, I encourage y'all to do that. Like, whatever yes. religion you believe in, I feel like you probably need to have somebody that's equally yoked with you, you know, just that's willing to take that step as well because I feel like the man is the leader. Yep. of the relationship right period i don't care what nobody says mm -hmm. they have to lead like and then the woman will follow mm -hmm. like if if i saw him this wasn't the case we both wanted to do it but if i saw him growing his relationship stronger with christ you know that that would just make me want right. to do it too mm -hmm. you know or i mean it can be the woman but the man should be the leader so right and and we definitely going we on a, on a path of righteousness and on a journey it's definitely but we find enjoying the journey. We, yeah. We're very joyful now. And it's trust just, the process. Yes, definitely. Got to trust the process. It's not going to be quick. It's not just going to be snap your fingers like every, everything's so good. Like yeah. be willing to to weather through that be, process. Yeah, together. Together, together. yes. That's how you know that person is the one. But right. the biggest thing, like the biggest things that I would say, peace, transparency, willing to transform, you know, because your old self, I mean, your self now is not your right. best self transform into your best best self with that person and sacrifice sacrifice definitely y'all gotta be willing to sacrifice it's not i don't feel like it, it'll work out if you're selfish at all right. like you can't be selfish especially if you want to be in a serious relationship so um that's all i have do you have anything that's all i have see y'all later um yeah. follow us on instagram marticia.lewis and i'm at trader ace and if you have any questions please feel free to dm us or email us at christek and lewis at gmail.com yeah y'all be safe peace, peace.